No, I think I'm going to do one more chapter. I have a couple things I want to do. I want to see if I can finish Team Buddies. Um, I want to see if I can finish Team Buddies before the next few days are done. It's not a long game. I'm learning that as I'm playing through it. I forget that everybody doesn't wear um, the same clothes in the levels as they do on the Somnial. It's a nice touch. Just remember that the first thing you see of that character is him firing at you and demanding you explain yourself. There's a pool now. Okay, I guess I'm going to be doing a lot of thing. That's not poo. Oh, that's what support status is. Between the two characters. Okay. I'll see what it is the first time. That, that's all I really need to see. Very nice. Alright, let's get this well, over with. Not push-ups. How hard do you want to go? Actually, yeah, look at the... How hard do you want to go? Yeah, as you can see, I did the push-ups again at some point. When I don't have that delay, I'm much better at it. it Alright, time to kill my arm again. How are the other difficulties, exactly? Oh my god. Great job! I'm so proud. How do you get a good? Let's do this again sometime. Let's not and say we did. I swear, if I had a dollar for every time X Split decided to do something stupid, I'd be a rich man. At least it told me the recording stopped. The fact that I have to be grateful for that is fucking embarrassing. Oh, hey, I didn't mention it before, but, um, at least me having two separate hair colors is seen as weird? <laughs> In-universe, I mean. I feel a bit better about that. Well, she mentioned the eye color, not the hair color. Maybe the hair color is still f normal for some reason. It's like, you're making fun of somebody's eye color? Way to make fun of a rare gene defect, asshole. So are we still sending Anna into the, uh, the wolf pit, I like to call it? Yeah. Everybody else is at least level 10. Everybody I care about, anyways. Not including, uh, Vander, who I've explained already, yes? Vandir is the last person who needs experience right now. Don't know how I passed Anna like three times. Hi there. You can call me Lady Anna. No. A training session with you should be interesting. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, you can hit and dodge. No, you're done. You're just done. It's me. Again? Everyone has an equal chance, right? Also, now he has less chance to hit. I swear, does it just pick a random weapon? This should be a fun workout. I was gonna lose my shit if it happened a third time. Just don't miss, Anna. There you go. Anna is a very silly character. I'm Citrine, Time to spend a the fragments. Of nobility. Celica, warrior priestess, at your service. Oh, you you lose. Uh, excuse me, Citrine. 
You're staring at me so intently. Can I help you with something? Oh, I was just admiring your dress. We seem to have similar tastes. Who's your designer? Uh-huh. If you say so. A royal soldier of Brodia. I am Marth. <laughs> oh, you just plain fucking loose. You can't get through the third of his two attacks. Second of his three attacks. Wow. You have incredible strength, Lapis. Our foes are fierce, but together we will reclaim peace. I'm not sure how useful I'll be, but I'll try. Let's wish ourselves luck, too. Couldn't hurt, right? Well, I said I was going to give one more chapter, so... One more chapter. Let me make sure that the healers are good. Um, yeah. Heal will probably work for a little bit yet. Does not count as a weapon. Okay. Now that's a cool looking JPEG. We're here. Brodia Castle. That's not fair for that. Now it's fair. Soldiers. Oh, thank goodness. The attack hasn't begun. Wait. There's someone in front of the gate. He doesn't look like a guard. Is it an enemy soldier? No. That's that's Diamant. He must have come out to greet us. I've been waiting for you, Divine One. I greet you as the Crown Prince of Brodia. I'm Diamant. He's gonna backstab me, isn't he? I just have this wacky feeling he's just gonna stab me in the back. I've heard so much about you. I'm honored to finally meet the legend in person. It's a pleasure, Prince Diamant. And Prince Alfred, welcome. Queen Eve's letter explained your situation. Thanks for coming all this way. It's good to see you. Likewise. I'm sorry it took a war for us to meet again after all this time. Oh, and Alcrist. Thanks for escorting our guests from the border. I know that's a rugged road. It was nothing, really. I bear ill news, however. Illusion forces attacked us at the Grand Crossing. Is that right? A battalion led by Princess Hortensia. We fought her off, but she said something troubling. The Crown Princess intends to assault Brodia Castle. If they're after our emblem ring, we may be on course for a dangerous confrontation. We'll have to prepare our defenses. Thanks for the warning, Alchrist. Come. Father will want to hear about this. Why do you all look so tense? Father, you were supposed to be waiting inside. Yes, I know. And I was, but then I had this feeling my boy Alchrist might be home. Seems my fatherly intuition was right, as usual. <laughs> Welcome back, son. Thank you, father. I wish you'd stop finding excuses to leave the castle. It's not safe out here. Please, Diamant, not another lecture. Where's the harm in welcoming my dear boy back from his journey? Anyway, we'd best not argue in front of our guests. Oh. It's all right. It's kind of wacky that he has a, uh, a, um, what, what's, an inferiority complex. Probably not even right. Um, but it, it's wacky when he has that and is, he seems to be a pretty cool father. Please, pardon my rudeness. Divine One, Prince Alfred, welcome. I am Morian, King of Brodia. Good to meet you. Likewise, I never imagined I'd meet the Divine Dragon. Indeed, such a special occasion calls for a welcoming duel. There's no time for that. We have an important matter to discuss. As all Christ was escorting our guests from the border, Illusion soldiers attacked them. Huh. <laughs> Illusions. It appears that the Crown Princess is planning an assault on Brodia Castle. Already making their move, huh? Soldiers, go now! Shore up our defenses! Yes, Your Majesty. Well done getting that information, Alchrist. Please, 
I don't deserve such kind Seriously, of where did this personality come from? Everyone in his family seems to be good people. Humble as ever, son. <laughs> King Morian, excuse me, but I need your kingdom's aid. You want our emblem ring, right? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. That's why I brought it. Here, the ring of the young lion. Hey, Diamond, think fast. Father, we're supposed to take care of the ring, not throw it around. Ah, you're no fun. Um, Alfred? Yes? King Morian seems so... nice. This is the man who's always invading Elusia? I thought he'd be more... intimidating. You're seeing Morian friend and family man. He's known to be a big-hearted guy. But in battle, the demon comes out. He's not someone you want as your enemy. Ugh. Father can be such a handful sometimes. Divine One, I've got the ring for you. Thank you. What will you do with it? I'm going to summon an emblem. Rise up. Emblem of binding. It's time for the anime intro again. Every time. Uh... Annoying reminder, we got Roy before we got Lindus. I'm Roy. If you're summoning me, that can only mean war has begun. There was a person in there? How about that? All along, this emblem dwelt in our family's ring. And now you have released him. It seems divine is no exaggeration, huh? You know, I would say Captain Obvious, but um, to be fair, uh, everybody seems to have this reaction. Urgent news, Your Majesty. An illusion Wyvern Rider is approaching. It's dodging all our archers' attacks. What? She's here. Divine One, may I call upon Roy's help to defend the castle? Of course. No. No, you don't need Roy. Princess Ivy, speak for the Illusion Throne. I will now take your lives, your souls, and the rings. I was under the uh, impression that fighting was not happening yet. I underestimated how far you could get into Brodian territory, Princess Ivy. My soldiers are on the way. Now, I will give you a chance to surrender before they arrive. Oh, I'm itching for that fight. Father, go back to the castle. What? Why? He's gonna die. If something happened to you, our country would be devastated. Please, leave this to us. Right. Why should the king get a say in the matter? I'll do as you ask. But, Diamant, Alchrist, don't you dare get killed. We won't. Well, we'll try not to. You must be the Divine Dragon. That's right. You really are as stunning as my sister said. I'm pleased to meet you. As is my ring. But that's... The ring of the Sage Lord. A gift from my father. With its power, I am sorry to say... I must kill you. I won't let that happen. It's you who will fall, Princess Ivy. You won't surrender, then. In that case, my forces will prepare for battle. As will ours. I'll stop at nothing to get those rings back. It just feels like a weird conversation. That, that's all I'm thinking of. Like, I, I came into this heavily fortified castle just to tell you to, to don't fight. Please, just give the ring over. That would be really cool if you did that. No? Okay. I'm, I'm just gonna kill everyone then. Is that cool? Yeah. Nope. Everything will be fine. She also has retainers. <laughs> I 
I'm just assuming anyone with retainers eventually joins my side. Why is it always two, though? It's such a weird thing. I mean, it's not a big deal, but it's just... I, I didn't even bother paying attention to the units. Holy shit. Yeah, not a whole lot. Not a whole lot to work with, I feel. Just select the people that I think will be good for the work. Uh, access everywhere, huh? I have too many sword users. Uh, you go back. Just for now. Um, uh, oh, thinking of different units to use is hard. <laughs> A second healer can't hurt. Especially if they can uh, use ranged attacks. I think this is the best course of action. Kind of just have to send a group of everything to each side, I think. It seems to be the smartest thing to do. <sighs> Finally, Horsey, you stopped! <sighs> Where were you taking me? Okay. Huh? Wait, uh... Is this the castle? Is that Prince Diamant? Amber? What are Illusion soldiers doing here? They've attacked us. Say, Amber, weren't you out fighting beasts? I was, but then Horsey got spooked and wouldn't listen to me. I kept getting tossed around on his back, and next thing I know, here I am. <laughs> I'll never understand how you end up in these strange situations. But this time, it works in our favor. I was just wishing you were here. Maybe Horsey sets this danger. That's so clever of you. This voice acting. Ready to defend the castle together? I was born ready. If our enemies reach the gate, the castle will be theirs. We can't allow that to happen. Oh, it's not even a timed mission. I've got I mean, it's certainly an option. That's cool. This is a lot to just throw at me at once. Please. Yeah, they give like no time before that's gone, huh? We will not relent until the castle is ours. If these enemies all come at once, our defenses won't hold. Our castle has a ballista. We can use that to pick them off. I remember in the original Fire Emblem game, Ballista was just a straight up unit. Goodbye. Oh, they have an animage. Cool animation. Yeah, let's go with the 98% chance of murder instead of the 93. I know it's not much, but uh, why take chances you don't need to? I'm just wondering, can I beat him without using Roy? Uh, not with him. Not without him uh, surviving. That's just not a smart idea. Oh, one of the other things I saw in Game FAQ since I did that for whatever reason. Uh, this will kill. I saw somebody just say if you use certain things in the game, then you didn't really beat it. Like, okay. That is certainly a opinion to have, and while it may be wrong, 
You're you're allowed to have it. I never understood people that want to gatekeep other people from enjoying the same thing. Why? What purpose does it serve to do that? So I'm thinking the most likely thing that's going to happen is the uh, Axe users are going to destroy these barricades. Yeah, smart thought. <laughs> yeah, this presents an issue. Uh, no less than three people who can who can attack her. That's a good sign. What did she just say? Okay, the possibility I may have made some questionable decisions is certainly there. I can't deny that. That doesn't even break either. A proud victory. Yeah, I don't care too much about him getting some of the experience. Anything to take the pressure off the front. <laughs> Bye. But they couldn't even do a proper animation of them aiming the ballista. Come, come on, Nintendo. It's not like that's unreasonable. <laughs> eh, I couldn't get the three percent. Oh well. The important thing is you tried. Uh, yeah, this is going to be necessary right now. That works for me. Remember. By all means, if you want to miss, then by just keep going. No, you want to fire. You you want to fire the bow. What weapon do you have? Doesn't have any uh, specialties. Inflicts ten of void down on a foe during. Oh, that's not too bad. Why is his yellow, though? What does that mean? Yeah, here we go. Oh, that just means high crit, doesn't it? That's the most likely explanation I can come up with. Anna hasn't had a chance to kill anything yet. I won't falter! And she's still not going to have a chance to kill anything. Very cool. <laughs> oh, man. That's fucking wacky. I just want to level up, damn it. I mean, there are some people that still need healing, but, uh, Chloe... Yeah need it more than anyone else at the moment. Yeah, you know what? You go ahead. You... You're not gonna be able to just tank the hit. You can weaken. You wanna weaken them? My name is Kagetsu. Pleased to meet you. If only it were under friendlier circumstances. <laughs> Yeah, you see, you're allowed to hit him with your 20% chance. 
Just target him. Leave now, or my duty demands you be destroyed. Nothing personal. Not gonna do shit with zero damage, friend. Okay, even if it crits both times, that's one health left. Wait, would firing the longbow increase range? No, of course not. That would be stupid. I didn't think it would, but it would have been funny if it did. 83%! You better hit! Or you're not getting this one either. Oblivion is near. How unfortunate. I must return to Princess Ivy. What's with the asterisks? Yeah, uh, make sure you hit, bro. Oh, Lord. everything will be fine. Cock and ball torture! It's described by Wikipedia! The online encyclopedia! Cock and ball torture is a sexual activity involving application of pain or constriction to the male genitals. This may involve directly painful activities, such as wax play, genital spanking, squeezing, ball busting, genital flogging, urethral play, tickle torture, erotic electrostimulation, or even kicking. The recipient of such activities may receive direct physical pleasure via masochism or emotional pleasure through erotic humiliation or knowledge that the play is pleasing to a sadistic dominant. Many of these practices carry significant- Everybody is failing right now. I don't have enough healers to compensate for this amount of missing. I am defeated. I must retreat. Jesus Christ, I can't imagine how horrifying this would have been if the difficulty was higher. That's a bad idea. Let's not do that. You should smack them. Oh, can you still hit the Lance user? God damn it. If I didn't need to heal anybody... Didn't even... <laughs> Such tenacity. Alright. I'll step in. With this ring, nothing and no one will take me down. Man. Even that soldier knew she was fucked if she attacked. AI tends to be suicidal as fuck in these games. And Anna is nowhere close by to get the kill. Cool. This is... just what happens. Yeah, just go ahead and stay up there, I guess. Oh, if you go even slightly closer. Yeah, you're gonna um, defend. You're gonna be. You're gonna get behind him. Yeah, you're just gonna. Um, you're just gonna be ready to snipe somebody. Cause I don't see this level going on much longer. Technically, yes, it does kill. With this emblem strength and my own, there will be no defeating me.
Anna is just not getting any experience today. You were beautiful while you lasted. Wait, she has her ex out. Yeah, kill her ex equipped. Master Lane? What? Okay, that's fucking weird. There's weapon advantage, less damage. Unit counters before attack. Oh, she just automatically counters. Wow, that's fucking... That's annoying as shit. That means an axe user is the best way to fight her. Well, that sucks. And if I just switch to Roy now, then she's just gonna use the axe. Wow. Good thing I check for this shit before I commit to anything stupid. My apologies. Yeah, this is gonna take several people. Or not. It doesn't have to take several people. Alright, then we're just gonna... Collect that, and move on. <laughs> Ask if I care that you attack first. And Anna did nothing. <laughs> Man. That sure is a lot of effort to try to get one character to catch up to everyone else. We recovered the ring, but the emblem is tainted with fell dragon energy. I'll have to summon him again myself. Free us, emblem of genealogy. Is this the other, uh, other protagonist of genealogy? Thank you for letting me swing a sword with these arms again. I, don't know. I will do what I can to retrieve that which has been stolen. Thank you, Leaf. It's a really cool character. I have nothing How could no knowledge I have on. Failed? It's over, Princess Ivy. Surrender. I will not. There is more for me to do. Casually walk away. No! Yeah. She's gone. Your Highness, urgent news from the border. What is it? An Aleutian battalion stands at the ready. King Hyacinth is acting as general. He's leading their army himself. What? Yes. And he is demanding to see King Morian. <sighs> I must face him. Anything less would bring dishonor to Brodia. Father, he's baiting you. This may be a trap of some kind. Go back inside. Go back in and take your medicine, old man. Ha! I can fight my way out of whatever trap he springs. I urge you to reconsider. Listen, who's the father and who's the son here? Stop trying to protect me. <laughs> Son, this has been happening a lot lately. What's it all about? Are you worried Brodia might lose this war? Or lose its king? 
We're not ready for any of this. Brodia to lose its king. Or me, my father. Diamond. From a young age, I was told I would lead Brodia after you died. Imagine, a boy forced to anticipate his father's death. To think of that empty throne. The Fell Dragon has returned. War is here. The future is uncertain. And I'm not ready. It's all right, Diamant. If I die, I die. Brodia will live on. But, father... What? You don't believe me? After I'm gone, I know you will lead with a steady hand. Though, I'm offended you expect that day to come so soon. You think I'm gonna lose, huh? You think I'm weak? That I need your protection? <laughs> oh, the hubris of youth. That's not what I meant. King Hyacinth awaits me on the field of war, his army at the ready. If Brodia hides, then what? After years locked in battle with Delusia, will we reveal ourselves as cowards? Listen to me, Diamant. I will fight bravely for Brodia. I do not fear death. Being known as a king who runs from battle? That scares me far more. <sighs> what do you think about this, Alchrist? Me? If I die, and Diamant alongside me, you will take the throne. <sighs> Dude, the kid is already fucking strangling himself over self-doubt. You wanna do more? <laughs> you wanna do some more shit? Father, don't say that. I... I will not let that pass. I will protect Diamant to the bitter end. Oh, Christ. Ha <laughs> ha, that's my boy! Diamond, you could learn a thing or two from your brother. Fear has no place in my kingdom. If we step into fear, then we step out of Brodia. <sighs> now then, to the border! It seems I can't dissuade you from this path. All I can do is walk it with you. Come on, everyone. Let's show Illusia why we're called the Kingdom of Might. Ha <laughs> ha! That's it. This won't be the last time I see the castle. And when I'm back, a tournament with our strongest warriors. That means you, Divine Warrior. Man, I can practically hear the entirety of Brodia raising their own personal death flag. Me? Yes, I want to see you transform into a mighty dragon. Whoosh! Roar! <laughs> oh, well, okay. What's the matter? Ah, oh, nothing. You're right. I could turn into a dragon. I can definitely do that. Ha 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 I'm looking forward to that. I'd like to spar with you too, Divine One. After a father gets his chance. But that's for later. Now, we should prepare for our journey to the border. Indeed. This talk turning into a dragon mother could can i i have no idea if i can or how money as this money will go towards the war effort and definitely not towards purchasing unnecessary outfits for the characters anywho ladies and gentlemen it has been a while um a couple hours now the game is great, but I gotta put it down. I'm sorry. Anyways. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Later!